Hello everyone. Welcome to YouTube channel Savita Board K. Today's lecture on XBRL, a powerful tool that is revolutionizing the way financial data is communicated and analyzed in project management. In this lecture, we will explore what XBRL is, its advantages and its disadvantages. So, let's start. Now let's understand first what is XBRL. XBRL stands for Extensible Business Reporting Language. It's a fancy name, but don't worry, I will break it down for you. XBRL is a language that helps us communicate financial information in a standardized way. It uses special tags to label different pieces of data, making it easier for computers to understand and process. Now, Let's talk about the advantages of using XBRL in project management. These advantages will help us see why XBRL is such a valuable tool. First advantage of XBRL is improved accuracy. XBRL eliminates mistakes that can happen when we enter data manually. This means we can trust the financial information we work with reducing the chances of making decisions based on wrong or outdated data. Second advantage of XBRL is enhanced data transparency. XBRL promotes transparency by making financial information accessible and easy to analyze. This helps project managers and investors make informed decisions based on reliable data, leading to better planning and control of projects. Third advantage is efficient data analysis. XBRL helps us analyze financial data quickly and accurately. It allows software to extract and compare data from different sources, which saves time and effort. With this, project managers can monitor project progress and evaluate performance more effectively. Fourth one is streamlined reporting processes. With XBRL, Preparing and submitting reports becomes faster and easier. We don't have to waste time reformatting data or typing it in manually. This frees up our time to focus on analyzing the information and making better decisions for our projects. Fifth and last advantage is interoperability and standardization. XBRL provides a common language for financial reporting. It ensures that different systems and organizations can understand and exchange data easily. This means we can collaborate with stakeholders and share financial information more efficiently. Now, let's consider the disadvantages of XBRL. It's important to understand that while XBRL has many advantages, there are also a few things we need to keep in mind. First disadvantage of XBRL is initial implementation costs. Implementing XBRL may require some upfront investment. This includes things like purchasing software licenses, training employees, and integrating XBRL into existing systems. This cost might be a challenge for smaller organizations or those with limited resources. Second one disadvantage is learning curve. XBRL has its own technicalities that we need to learn. This might take some time and effort, especially for those who are new to XBRL. But don't worry, with practice and training, it becomes easier to work with XBRL. Third one is data quality and integrity. XBRL relies on the accuracy of the data we enter. If the data is incorrect or incomplete, it can lead to mistakes in our analysis. So, we need to make sure we are entering the right data to get meaningful insights. Fourth one is complexity for small projects. XBRL is designed for complex financial reporting. For small projects with simpler financial structures, implementing XBRL might add unnecessary complexity and overhead. In such cases, it's important to weigh the benefits against the costs. Fifth one and last disadvantage is compatibility and transition challenges. Moving to XBRL may require updating existing software systems or investing in new ones. 
This can be challenging, especially for organizations with older systems or limited IT resources. Planning and managing the transition carefully can help overcome these challenges. To wrap up, XBRL is a powerful language that brings many advantages to project management. It improves accuracy, enhances transparency, streamlines reporting processes, and promotes interoperability. However, it's important to consider the implementation costs, learn the technicalities, ensure data quality, and evaluate the suitability for specific project needs. Thank you for joining me in this lecture on XBRL. I hope you now have a better understanding of what XBRL is and how it can benefit project management. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. If you like our lecture like and share to your friends. Don't forget subscribe our channel.